Hi, it's Phil Stone, and this is the Phil Stone Training Series. And in this video, we're going to show you how to use the Social Monkey Free Backlink Builder. This is a tutorial for anybody who wants to get backlinks to anything that they put up online articles, videos, anything. Now, if you build backlinks as part of your SEO strategy, Social Monkey is really for you. It's a great system. First of all, it's free. Second, it's very simple to use. And third, it gets results. You can get 25 backlinks per day using their free version of the system. You can actually upgrade $47 and you can do 100 backlinks per day or you can actually earn that by getting referrals. I'll tell you how to do it. Go to http colon forward slash forward slash philipjstone.com and remember Philip has two L's and then forward slash social underscore monkey. Simple as that. So you go to that site, social monkey, and this is what you'll see really simple form you just sign up first name email address and password and you're in the system very very simple now all you have to do to put this all together is to put in a URL and they'll actually check to make sure that you haven't submitted it before so it helps prevent double submissions really very cool the title of whatever it is you're going to put up there a description and written all out and then the tags you pick a category and you're really done the only thing you have to be aware of is the potential for duplicate content. For example, when you're writing the title out, you're going to want to spin that title so you have variation, so it's not a duplicate title that goes out to all 25 bookmarking sites. The same thing holds true with the description. That needs to be spun as well. The same goes for the tags. All of that has to be spun. But don't worry, they have a really nice tutorial right there on the page. You can actually watch the video. But let me give you some basics. Now you notice here it says click here to spin with the best spinner. I use the best spinner to spin things all the time. I use it for a number of different programs. For article spinning that I'm going to use when I'm putting up articles online, I use it when I'm using SE Nuke X, which is a very elaborate program that I use for SEO. I also use it when I'm doing tweet adder tweets because it takes forever for me to actually type them out. Tweet adder actually has part of their system where it will allow spin syntax and Social Monkey, obviously really very cool. By the way, you can find these tools and others at philipjstone.com forward slash super dash tools forward slash if you want to see some of the things I use online. Now, if you're thinking, oh my God, I've got to learn another thing, spin syntax, I understand, I feel your pain, but it's really not tough at all. Here are some basics. You just have the left brace, the vertical bar, and the right brace. And let me show you an example. Let's say that you had a very simple sentence. The sky is a beautiful deep blue. Well, let's just talk about the word deep right now. We could replace that word with a lot of different other options. It could be deep or it could be shade of or color. We could even do a lot more than that. So if you think about it, just using those three words, we'd have three basic different sentences we could create. The sky is a deep blue. The sky is a beautiful shade of blue or the sky is a beautiful color blue. Now the way we do that, if you have a program that can actually take spin syntax and create those variations, all you do is you put that right into the line. If I write out the line, the sky is a beautiful, then I use the left brace, the word deep, then the vertical bar, then shade of, then a vertical bar, then color, then the right brace. What it does is it'll tell that program to choose those different options when it puts this up. So I have basically all three of those sentences that will come right out of this written this way. Now if you think about it, if I want to multiply my options because obviously these are different but they're not really that unique, I can actually go to the word beautiful and I could replace that with awesome or magnificent or any other number of adjectives and create multiple combinations. I could even use the word sky. I could use heavens there as a variation. That's the basics of spin syntax. It's really, really very simple. And if you want to see how it's done, more about it, go to the Phil Stone training series video, What is Article Spinning? It's a very short video. It'll, it'll give you more information on all this. This whole program is really very, very cool. You create whatever it is you're going to send out, then you click Submit, the system schedules it, and then you get a report back, and that's one of the coolest parts of this. You actually look online and see how well you did. They'll do 25 free every day. So I did it. I wanted to send out 
backlinks to my video that I have on testimonials for personal branding and that's an interesting part of the strategy as well you might want to take a look at the video that we have building backlinks and link wheels inside of the Philstone training system because right here what I'm doing is not sending backlinks or bookmarks directly to my main site I'm sending them to a video that has a actual URL in the video description title that points to my main site so it's really part of a link wheel system but if you take a look at what's here tremendous I've got all of these bookmarks that actually occurred automatically just by that one little thing takes about 10 minutes to do it simple stuff and as a matter of fact if you want to see more about what you can do as far as online marketing go to philipjstone.com I'll be there waiting for you have a great one bye bye